What's going on guys? It is me, Jay-Z Gaming, back here with another video. Today, I'm going to be showing you guys how you can make your very own red berry, far red berry pie farm. Yeah, so guys, before we get into the actual video, I just want to show you, I made a few modifications to my TMC's thing. Uh, yeah, huge shout out to Skittle, my Discord moderator, for hooking me up with all this cool furniture that I could use. And he gave me a ton more, so... So Skittle, the moderator, <laughs> thank you. And also, I want to give another huge shout out to Bob the Builder on my Discord server for giving me this pumpkin hammer. Now, see, I didn't want to take his pumpkin hammer, but he kind of tricked tricked me into taking it. So, <laughs> Bob the Builder, thank you. I just want to say, I did not scam him. <laughs> All right, guys, so let's get into the materials to start off. Now, you're going to need a lot of stuff for this. Um... I just hooked up the basic here so you guys won't have to watch all this. So you're going to have a normal industrial chest, then an input output chest, then you're going to want to have an industrial oven, this is very important, then your food processor, but you're going to want to open up your food processor and select berry dough. Okay, that's insanely important. You don't do that, it won't work. Uh, we're going to put the coal totem here at the end. Um, okay, we're going to put the coal totem here at the end. Um, because I just don't need like a ton of despawn happening right now. But guys, let's get into the actual thing. So for this, what we're going to be doing is we're going to have... This is Bob the Builder, by the way. Um, so guys, we're going to have a little tower thing right here. So we're going to build up a few blocks. I'm going to be doing three here. Just like that. And then make sure you put some blocks right down here too. I'm sorry that's dark out. It's probably not the best I'm using obsidian for this, but hey, I got a lot of it. So actually I'm gonna build up one more block just to be safe. So guys, make sure you you're gonna need a lot of blocks for this, sorry. All. That's one thing that's I mean, blocks shouldn't be a problem if you're building this farm, because this is a pretty expensive farm to build, but hey. Okay, so once you have this little tower thing here, make sure you have a way to get up, because you're probably going to fall a lot. You're going to want to build out five blocks here, so including this one. So two, three, four, and five, just like that. And then you're going to want to come over to this side and do the same thing. So two, three, four, and five. Okay, then we're going to go into our inventory. Sorry for the lag here. Okay, we're going to keep that. We don't need our berries out. Don't need our dragon slayer or our ruby stuff. Okay, so we're going to grab our food processor. Just like that. We're going to grab our conveyors. Very important. I'm using two, tier 2 for this because I have them, but if you don't have tier 2 conveyors, then just use tier 1s. They'll work. And then let's grab our grass too at the same time. We'll worry about our totems later. Okay, so oh finally it's beginning to be starting to be daytime again. Okay, what you're gonna want to do is you're, you're gonna grab your conveyors and you're gonna put one on each side just like this, okay? And then this isn't mandatory, but just in case any blocks like fall out or anything like that, put uh, some blocks right here. And may as well put some here, right? Okay, so next, this is kind of annoying to do. You're going to grab your food processor. And you're going to want to put it right here. On each side, just like that. Alright, so let's just briefly review this. Food processor, then we're having a spot for cold totem, or oven, and there are two chests. Then we have this little drop-off area and our food processors. Okay, so this side is going to be our wheat side. So if you open this up, you don't have to do anything to it. It's dough automatically. And on our left side, we're going to be doing berry dough. Not berry dough. Yeah. Wait, berry dough? Yeah, it's berry dough. Wait, hold up. Okay, we don't actually need a food processor on this side. Sorry about that. <laughs> okay, so we're just going to grab... Our conveyors and we're going to stretch these across 
Okay, and on this side, you're going to want to put two more blocks down, just like this. Yeah, let's do the weed side first. This will be easier. And then we're going to just like that. All right. Then we're going to want to do the same thing that we did over there. And we are going to put down a little drop shoot thing. Sorry about that. So then you're going to want to put conveyors on each side, just like this. Just like that. And then you're going to want to surround the outsides here with obsidian. Then you're going to grab your grass. Please don't lag out of the game. Please don't lag out. Okay, good. Okay, then you're going to want to grab your grass just like this. And you're going to want to put three blocks away. So if you look from above, you should have one conveyor right down there. Okay. I'm sure you guys don't really need an explanation on how to put down grass. <laughs> so I'll just skip to when this part's done. And great, the tree's in the way. Yeah, okay guys, so I'll just skip to when I finish putting down the grass. Because you don't really need to see me doing that. Guys, I'll be right back. Okay guys, I'm back. So next thing that we're going to do <clears throat> is we're going to plow all this land. <laughs> yeah, so it's a little pain, but it'll be worth it. Alright, again, you guys don't need to see me do this, so I'll be right back. Okay, guys, then you're going to want to fill all this up with wheat seeds. Okay, then you're going to want to throw down your wheat totems. And guys, that is one of the reasons that you're going to want to have this bottom food processor already set. Because this is already, this is going to start producing dough very soon. Okay, so th then the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to repeat this whole thing. On another level so just like this so we're I'm basically gonna do this whole thing again just on a different level so oh okay. great yeah so I would highly recommend doing at least two levels I'm just gonna do it two levels for now because I don't need a ton of coins right now <laughs> I have pretty much all the coins I need right now so yeah I'll see you guys once I finish this next level. Okay guys, so as you can see here, I have finally finished building this. Um, <laughs> yeah, so I basically just copied the... Oh, of course, I fell down there. I just basically copied the two layers. Um, yeah, okay, I gotta reset. <laughs> yeah, so I basically just copied the first layer on top of the second one. I'm gonna be doing more in the future, but because I have limited time, uh, I'm only gonna be doing two today. So. The next part that we need to move on to is obviously the berry part. So we've got wheat, that's good, but to make berry pie, we also need berries. So let's work on that part now. Another thing I wanted to say is that you can replace this berry section with any type of pie, oh gosh, any type of ingredient that you want. So if you want to make carrot cake, you could replace the berry section with carrots. Um, I think you could do an orange farm. There's a number of different, different things you can do. You can place, replace it with um, tomatoes to make pizza. Yeah, because that would work because we have enough space here. Yeah, so it's a little nice thing that you can do. Okay, we're basically going to want to do the same thing that we did over there to here. So just a few blocks up. Of course, it has to be darker when I finish. Just like this. Yeah, that'll work. Okay, so then we're going to want to do the same thing that we did before with this little, I don't know, almost like a star pattern thing. About that. Okay, so then we're going to want to do the same thing with the conveyors, just like this. Come on. So it's generally the same thing, except... Instead of using uh, wheat, we're just using berries, which berries are a ton easier. Guess I don't know if you saw that, but we've already had a few pieces of dough go through, which is nice. But oh, come on. <laughs> it also means that I got to hurry up the berry making. Otherwise, we're just going to have way too much dough. Now, you guys could hook up a totem disabler to this if you really wanted to disable it, but... I don't really see why you'd want to disable it, because it wouldn't be too insanely laggy. It's not a very huge farm. 
yeah, so you could disable it. You don't need to, though. Okay. Yeah, so now we're just going to put the rest of the... Okay, I need something to walk on. Just put the rest of the grass in. So, same thing as usual as last time. Three for each obsidian block. I don't think you guys really need to watch me do that again, so I'll do that off camera. I'll be right so back. after you have that done, we're just going to grab our red berry seeds and then our, our red berry totems, yeah. Now, you could also... Well, no, never mind. <laughs> I think... Who else thinks that they should really add... um. Other types of berry, uh, what do you call them? Like blueberry pie and blackberry pie and stuff like that. I think that would, be, that would be a good addition and they could like sell for way more. I don't know. Just a thought. Okay, then throw in your red berry totems. Pretty simple. Oh, the lag's coming in. I've been recording for too long. <laughs> okay, and then... You can probably guess this yourself. Then you just throw in the berry seeds. Okay, guys. So I'm gonna throw. I'm gonna put in the berry seeds, and I'm gonna do another level. You guys don't need to see me do all this. So, yeah. I'm just gonna do that. I'm well. I'm doing this just so I can get to the next level. But guys, I'll do all that, and I'll be right back once the farm is finished. Okay, guys. I just finished building this. Um, I actually added the third level because I saw how fast the wheat was coming. But apparently, um, Bob the Builder on my Discord server has spotted a problem. So, okay, I think I see it. Uh, okay, he is getting trapped. Okay, he wants build. I trust him, so. Guys, I know this guy in real life. I trust him. Don't give builds to people you don't know, okay? This is very important. You might get scammed. So don't get builds to people you don't know in real life. It's on. <laughs> okay, and I see a potential problem with the berry farm too. <laughs> okay. He thinks I like to torture him. I am recording, right? Yep. Look through your food processor, what? <laughs> okay, show us where the problem is. Please. Okay, so yeah, so guys, just like I just did, um, or Bob the Builder, you, you heard nothing, um, put some blocks down here, right close to the food processor, so that the wheat doesn't fall out. So he spotted an issue, he fixed it, thank you Bob the Builder. Okay, and I'm just going to throw some stuff in here too, just in case. Now, if you were to replace the berry bushes with tomatoes, what you need to do is you need to put a food processor right where these conveyors are, right where my cursor is. Um, and you need to make that tomato sauce. Okay, pumpkins. Okay, I just out of curiosity, have we made any berry dough yet? No, we haven't. Yeah, so the berries haven't started coming through yet. That's why I added another layer, <laughs> because we obviously need more berries. So yeah, I'm just really quickly going to replace this with, with some of that. And then may as well throw one right there too. <laughs> okay, I need some pumpkins. I'm going to go get him some pumpkins real quick. Uh, yeah, so <clears throat> before I do that, guys, thank you for watching. This is your automatic berry pie farm. So this, but yeah, guys, so thank you so much for watching. Uh, I'll have a link to my Discord server in the description. This video recommendation came from people in my Discord server, so guys, go join that so you can so you can uh, help decide what the future videos are. So, 
yeah guys hope you enjoyed this uh simple tutorial <laughs> this farm will get you a lot of money guys so oh yeah for almost forgot um we gotta throw that cold tone down so let's do that real quick Okay, uh, let's grab some coal totems. I mean, we only need one. Don't do more than one, please. Your despawn will be through the roof. Okay, so we should get some berries coming through soon. Okay, guys, so one more thing you can do if... Uh... Uh... One thing you can do if you think the berries aren't coming through fast enough is you can grab some berries that you already have. <laughs> like me, I have 5k. So just go in first person mode and just spam drop these. You will get lots. <laughs> lots and lots of berry pie. Nope, not food. Oh no, that that's not good. That's really not good. Don't accidentally drop food processors into a food processor. Okay, so as you guys can see, the berry dough is going through. Got some coal in there, and it's going to turn into berry pie. Okay, I need those food processors back. Like, now. Okay, I'm just going to break this. There we go. Food processor. Oh, come on. Oh, no. Stuff is going everywhere. Oh, no. This is not good. There we go. Okay. Yeah, so you guys can drop um, berries in here yourself, which is what I like to do if I don't have enough coming through. Yeah, so as you guys can see, we got lots of berries coming through. So, yeah. So, yeah, if you want more berry, if you want more stuff, just drop the berries in. Yeah. So, guys, link to my Discord server will be in the description. Um, I hope this farm works out well for you. There we go. See, we already got berry pie coming in. Coming in. Did I put this input up? I just wrong. What? Okay. Well. Yeah, guys. So this is gonna get you lots of berry pie. <laughs> I hope this helped you out, guys. Um, if it did, like, subscribe to the channel. Um, and I'll be making more content like this. Hopefully, in the f hopefully right away. So, guys, I really hope you enjoyed. Um, leave a like, comment, subscribe. If anything um doesn't work for you, let me know and I'll help you out in the comments. Join my Discord server. So you can be part of um, <clears throat> helping out these video guys. videos will be. <laughs> so guys, thanks for watching. I hope this helps you out. And guys, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.